All right, so we're out here on uh, the green of hole number 18 at Baton Rouge Country Club. Uh, it's a fairly long par five. So to this point, we hit our third shot just a little long and right, and it left us here on the, uh, on the collar of the green. Now, amongst amateur players, one of, the, uh, one of the biggest mistakes that amateur golfers make is improper club selection around the green. So just to demonstrate that, we're on the collar of the green and we got tons of green to work with. So the ideal play here would be a bump and run to get the ball on the green and let it run, uh, you know, to get it on the green as quick as possible and let it run out to the hole. So I got with me here to demonstrate that. I have a 58 degree and then I also have an 8 iron. I'm going to hit both uh, just to kind of demonstrate how the 8 iron would be more beneficial to getting on the green and letting it roll. So, I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate and hit both. Alright, so a little fat and left the ball uh, extremely short. That was That's kind of what's expected when you hit a high lofted wedge around the greens in this kind of scenario. So I also have an 8-iron and then I'm going to go and demonstrate uh, the proper shot to get it on the green and let it release out. Alright, so And you can see a lot more accurate shot and you leave yourself a better chance to get up and down for par from this spot.